G'day guys, welcome to my next shader tutorial and this tutorial we'll be learning about antistropic and the translucent material. So what is antistropic material? Antistropic is pretty much a advanced glossy type of material which controls the various roughness, antistropy and the rotation. Let's see what it does. If we connect it to the, the, to the surface of the texture, we can see that it does have some characteristics um, to it that differs from the material. We can here have more control over the roughness and the reflection of each of the material. Here we can create a very um, blurry glossy material or if we um, divide it we can create a very oh, I'm sorry this is the um, blurred material glossy and if we change the roughness and the antistropy up we can create a blurred mirror material. It's something you have to go through for each one to try and get the actual characteristics to what suits you. We always have the rotation. If we rotate it you can see the wavelength being distorted in the actual image. We also have the normal and tangent. As I said with normal, we don't have anything here, but with the tangent, it affects the UVing of the reflections. So if I have it, um, let's just say, to a window, the reflection to change based on that uh, tangent. Which can be very useful to reflection based um, uh, mappings. The next is the translucent material. Let's have a look on it by itself. Translucent is pretty much a material that is um, best for skin, milks, whack, um, wax, um, and other sort, sorts of liquids. To really um, justify this uh, material, we would have to mix it with something else. Don't worry about mixing as this will be later in the tutorial, but let's just have a look. If we mix glossy and translucent together, let's see what we get up, come up with. Right now we have a glossy sort of um, jello, not jello, more of a candy sort of um, material. It's a glossy, but a glossy material that's light's being penetrated in a way that is showing off the top layers. This can be very useful, as I said, with skin, milk, um, juice, and other sorts of liquids. Thank you for um, watching this tutorial, and I'll see you next time.